Hey, how you doing? Justin here. Today, I want to let you know all about Just a Guitar Tabs, a new feature over on the website. Getting tons of questions about it, and I thought the easiest way would be to do a little video and explain. I'm just going to share my uh, laptop screen with you so that you can actually see what is going on, explain what is going on exactly. But basically, we have tabs over on Just a Guitar now. I've negotiated a deal where, with publishers. You have to pay for it, but that's just the deal that people who write the songs need to get paid to. Uh, there are some things that are included, some things that are not. I want to go through it all with you now in a close-up. So uh, let me put my glasses on and share my screen. Okay, so here we are over on the website. First thing you need to do before you can buy or check out the tabs is to log in. I'm just going to log in here. So let's have a look first of all at what you got. So let's just go to the songs section. Uh, straight away we don't need all of this stuff let's zoom that up so the basic idea there's two types of uh, tabs that we've got here this one if we go to wish you were here first of all is a good example that's got both if we click on here this link that says tab you can see here first of all we've got this chord lyric stuff so there's the chords for the song we've got the words with the chords above there's a bunch of things that we can do here first of all we can transpose stuff so we can use the plus button to move change the keys of the chords okay that works on all of these ones that are chord lyric stuff you can see there a font button there grayed out because you can only do that in a new window which i'll show you in a second there's also a view tabs button i'll talk about that in a second i just wanted to explain this bit first of all dark mode puts everything white on black people watching it at night highlight chord uh, is gives you this little bit of uh, uh, background underneath the chords to just highlight where they are i think it's a good thing chord color you can change the color of the chords in case you don't want it to be the same color as before and actually you can change the typeface as well if you prefer Vedana or whatever i'm typesetting them in courier so i think that's probably going to be the most reliable most of the time now the other thing that i should explain here is this new window so if we open it up in a new window now we've got a, the whole thing in full screen and now we can start trying to crank the font size up if you wanted to do it that way uh, the problem, yeah, we're just starting to get some of that there where the, the chords encroach a little on the uh, lyrics when it gets too big. So there is a limit to that sort of stuff. Actually, I've gone too far the other way now as well. Now, uh, view tabs you can do in either. And this is the other type of tab that we've got. And this isn't for every song. Right now, it's about 150 songs have these uh, full tabs. There's a couple of things we're changing already. It just instead of having these dots here, we're going to have page numbers. We're working on that right now. It should be released probably within a week. Uh, that little feature. You can, of course, go back from here. You can see, do a view all, and then you have all of the tabs on one big scrollable uh, page there, if that's what you wanted. Instead, some of these, like for me, this particular tab is a little bit overly complicated. So uh, seeing as it's proven popular and I can afford to, I'm going to have some helpers go through and refine these a little bit and make them a little bit clearer. Uh, you know, I just find that these a lot of these kind of tabs that I got from my publisher are just a little, little on the overcomplicated side. They're correct. They're very correct, but sometimes a little too correct. So that's the two different types that we've got now that opened in a new window obviously so if i go back to my first one there you can view tabs here just on the regular um page all the same stuff uh, uh applies so we've got the video lesson i absolutely need to review uh, that lesson because that that lesson i did i don't know ten, more than 10 years ago way more than 10 years ago so what you'll find is some songs uh dead arrive here's a good example this is probably just going to have the chords i suspect oh actually i've got tabs as well okay so that's got the uh the chords again and it's got the tabs okay i was about to say i need to put the tabs in for the intro and the riff but actually uh we've got that one already so that wasn't a particularly good example uh sultan's a swing is that have we got that one i think we do Oh, no. Okay. So the tab is missing for that one. That's one that I wanted to tweak because the original one didn't have exactly the same uh, fingerings of, as the lesson. And I'm, you know, I think mine's right. So I'm going to tweak that. So that why, that's why that one's not there. There's a, a few of those that really should have it. Old Man's probably another one without a tab because, oh no, I've got a tab for that one. Oh yeah. No. Okay. That one's good. So some will have that, and this one, I think, has just got the chords. Okay, this one doesn't have the chords in it because the chords were getting a little bit complicated. Actually, we could have it for that one. 
like I said, all of these things where, where this is a working project. Um, I wasn't exactly sure how, how much people were going to dig it. And so, uh, you know, I've, I've launched it, but now that it's popular, I'm going to really, really wail in and make this awesome. So let's get into some of the fact here. Uh, so there's 600 songs altogether. It's about 150 of them uh, have that full tab thing. Um, we've already had a lot of requests for saying which 150, uh, and we're going to do that very soon. We're also on this songs page. We're going to find a way of putting in here which ones have got the chords and lyrics, which ones have got the tab, which ones are in the app, and which ones are in songbooks. That's something we're working on again that will hopefully be with us very soon. Uh, let's go back to the tabs page there. Uh, we talked about the transposing, you know, talked about them all being approved. So there's no more of this like having a look on uh, uh, whatever other tab sites that you know where they're not done by professionals and that can all get a little bit hazardous. Um, so it's fifty dollars US dollars, forty nine ninety nine a year or seven ninety nine a month. Uh, there is this special twenty percent discount, but it's only f it's only until tomorrow. So uh, if I get this video edited, you might have a day to grab it. Um, now, downloading the tab, you you can't download it and you can't print it. Basically, it wasn't something that I could get in in the license agreement. So when you're on here, there isn't any way of printing this page. There's no print tab button. The same on when you when you're looking at this, you can't print it. You know, there's I think uh, some people can print their screens. I can't stop you from doing that, but I can't. Uh, there's no print button. Uh, will I be adding more songs? Yes, absolutely. I'll be adding more songs. Um, the, the deal is that I'll be able to make uh, new tabs for new songs as I make them. And I'm also going to be adding some more of my jazz transcriptions and stuff like that as well. Um, ending your subscription will be over on the dashboard. So if you're signed in, you just simply go to Just a Guitar to your dashboard and then you go to purchases. And I'm hoping it will show up for me. And it's not there. Maybe I didn't have to pay for it, but that's where I would normally... Um, uh, be able to cancel it. That's a little bit funny that I don't even know how to do that. I'm assuming that my developer has just got it for me, but that's where you cancel it if you need to. Um, the uh, are these all my transcriptions? No. So the the chords and the chord lyric charts are ones that me and the team have done. The full tabs are currently from the publishers, except for some. So uh, for example, I just added Superstition a little minute ago. Superstition by Stevie Wonder, just because I did a lesson on that just a couple of days ago, and I added a tab. And this tab is one that I just did super quickly, showing the main riff and the chords for the chorus. And this is the kind of thing I can do pretty quickly and get it out there. We may or may not go ahead and do an even more uh, full on kind of a tab for that or that one. Uh, it's in US dollars because US dollars are most of my market is in the States, about 30% of you all from America. Uh, it's nothing to do with the, the Justin Guitar app. Now, this is something a, a, a quite a few people have asked about, like what's the difference between the app and the tabs? Well, the app is a, like a karaoke guitar play along specifically designed for beginners. It's only chords, it's chords above the lyrics, it's a player, it sounds great, it's great fun to jam along with. This is literally just the sheet music, so they don't play. I guess it's, it's useful for beginners, the transposing thing, maybe even again for complete beginners, that might be a bit overly complicated. Where this is really good is kind of intermediate level and above where you've got tab. So as soon as the songs get a little bit more complicated, you want that extra tab in there, not just the chords. So um, that's definitely the, the direction of this is, is going to be heading into like more tabs and showing power chords and riffs and all of that sort of stuff. So that's kind of where it's going and that's the separation between the app and this project the app is very much you get the whole course you get the practice routines the scheduler there's so much stuff going on on the app which is a beginner focused uh thing to help you get better on guitar this is literally just like an online songbook i guess is the easiest way to describe it if people really can't afford my products or any of them, I give them away. So if you really want to do music theory and you genuinely just can't afford $9.99 every six months, then we'll give it to you. Just email in assist at justinguitar.com. We'll sort it out. This product, I'm unable to do that. Uh, but I have a new project out, uh, Justin Guitar Assist. There'll be more on that in the next newsletter or two. Um, which is basically a fund that I'm putting aside where a share from the profits I get from these things and from donations and stuff like that will go toward buying guitars for people who can't afford to pay for guitars. Potentially, it's going to get them uh, access for the tabs as well, but I kind of feel like getting guitars in people's hands is kind of a little bit more important. 
But we're working on ways of, of getting all of this information for anyone who really can't genuinely afford it. I really hope that's given you a bit of an understanding about this new Just The Guitar Tabs project. Quite a few people have been emailing in asking questions about it, so I thought it was easiest just to make a quick video like that now. But I will remake this and get a little bit more detail. But there's a few lo those little tweaky things that I want to get sorted out first and get it just so. I want to add some more tabs in. Uh, definitely going to get a list ready of all of the songs that have got the full tabs for those people that have been requesting that as well. Um, yeah, once you've purchased it, there's not like another site that you need to go to. You you hit that buy button, then you just go and check out the songs and you click on that tab, uh, the tab tab uh, beneath the video, and that will show you what's available, whether it's chord and lyrics or the tabs. Uh, I know that we need to find a, a better way to show which ones have got the chord lyrics and which ones have got the tabs to make that clearer. Working on it, uh, you know, it's been much more successful than I even possibly hoped so uh, I will definitely be working on myself much more and, and, and getting some assistance to help out on it as well. Uh, I'm sure this is going to be a, you know, a rockin' project and I hope that many of you really enjoy it. I'll see you for plenty more very soon. You'll take care of yourselves. Bye-bye.